It's the full moon in October. Oh! Okay, you gotta hit these blackfish because there's some absolutely dynamic sized fish getting caught. The scales have been tipped over the personal best by our very own offshore Harry, over 12 pounds. You know, unbelievable. We've seen fish nine pounds. We've seen double digits come in. A lot of fish getting released. There's such a great bite going on right now. You can mix it up between like Connecticut out on uh, 11B. There was a hot red bite going on out on the reef by Smithtown. The sea bass have been like really either like beautiful size on some of these uncharted wrecks or little spots of rocks away from the other folks. And uh, other than that, if you're in like some of these other more popular, it seems like we're getting a lot of smaller sea bass. But I'll tell you, man, some chunky, chunky porgies in the mix. Uh, the false albacore here, they're on and off. Prep for those. Make sure you got really ultra light uh, fluorocarbon. Already have your setup ready to go with your favorite jig on or your popper or whatever it is if you're a fly guy because they're going to make a show and you have to be prepared. You almost have to drop what you're doing and, uh, and, and hit them. And then they'll show up on and off. They do their thing, you know. So stick to your guns. Keep your eyes out. There's nothing better than a great pair of sunglasses. I use coasters all the time. This is that time of the year you really, really want to have a great pair of glasses because it's a lot of sight fishing look for those rips we've got bluefish we've got fantastic striped bass it's got jumbos the smaller fish in the mix but they're out there in the rips this full moon it's on it's on on the south shore it's on on the north shore get out there enjoy it with a friend create memories practice your safety really keep your eye peeled for those wind because it is been howling you know, seriously. And at times you gotta watch out for that wind. And then there's a break, you hit it, the fish are hungry, they're chewing. Get out there, if your boat's too small, get on one of the for hire boats. We've got plenty out there that are doing a great job supporting the uh, fishing community. Get on there, kick in your money, tip those mates and have a great time. And until next week, I bid you peace and tight lines.